Hi guys, this is Crafty Mim. I'm trying to straighten out my camera here. Sorry if it's wobbling. Stop wobbling. Um, so, yes. This view <laughs> of sideways or up and down narrow is going to go away. I have decided to upgrade my phone and take the plunge to go into an iPhone, which I have never owned, never worked, never even played with. So <laughs> it's kind of scary, intimidating, and exciting all at once because I might be able to get better views. It's going to be the iPhone 11 Pro. Um, I'm hoping it should be coming in the mail anytime and hopefully it should be here so by the end of the week I can have the long view, the, the normal view of what you guys show. <laughs> I've tried to use this phone to do it but it flips sideways and I don't, there's times it looks normal, it's other times it doesn't and I get frustrated. So anyhow, so that's not what I'm on here about. I'm on here to show and share my it's not done yet obviously it doesn't have a tassel and it is not bound but I have been working on this journal this Halloween journal here um, that yeah it's been I've been slowly working on it because of the fact of camping and I meant to be up here all weekend to do it but things came up my daughter had to go to the hospital with her bad back you know things came up so I didn't stay at the campground this weekend until I always stayed up until yesterday morning and I wasn't supposed to come home just till this evening but that's it that's all right for my kids I'll do anything so got gave me time to work on this last night here at the house um, in my shed where I, I can watch TV and I have plenty of room to sprawl things out even though I have sprawled things out my desk is a hot mess right now so this is I added this this is Tim Holtz knob that I got a Hobby Lobby and then this is a Tim Holtz adornment I got at Michaels these are fringes I got from Joann's. Were they from Joann's? I think they were. So I got those in there throughout the book. Material I got from Joann's to cover a book. Um, this is from uh, the pad I got haunting. Happy hauntings from Tuesday morning. And then, of course, we got some Tim Holtz uh, ephemera. And this is a stamp I stamped out. This is a Tim Holtz fence that I put in there as a little pocket to hold. These are uh, printouts from Etsy. I can't remember who it was. I got it from Sorry. But it's the collection of October 31st so I thought it was awful cute these are from Michaels as well no Joann's I'm sorry Joann's and so then it goes on I got mixed mash of everything in this book but it's turning out so cute these are just a pocket right here and then this is a just a you can put something in there as a whole holding thing and then of course tea dye paper I put I watched somebody and they used corrugated um, cardboard to give lines which I thought was pretty cool this one I sewed together this is from the Happy Hauntings collection and then tea dye paper a doily from I think Michael's I don't know. I don't know where I have the stuff I got this stuff from. <laughs> this is from an embossing folder. I embossed and stamped. I think this is from, yeah, this is from uh, Graphic 45. These are from the printouts. From, and I put um, tea dye paper on the back of it for journaling. 
and all these are that way. So, and then the paper clip is to hold them in place. And then here again, some more journaling cards. made a pocket here. You can put anything in there that you want. Some music paper. This is, came from a book that Kim Kimba Creation sent me. Thank you, Kim. It's nice, sturdy paper. There are secrets. Some there are some secrets which do not permit themselves to be told. <laughs> Edgar Allan Poe. Uh, it says, Beware the Witching Hour. So this is a collection of the October 31st. And I love it. It's beautiful. I just put some little add-ons. I said these are ribbons. They were wired and I pulled the wire out of the sides. This is from Reminisce. I can't remember the Halloween collection. And then this is a um, envelope I made from a die. This is a Recollections uh, sticker. You can put stuff in that pocket. And then these are some ephemera I had created. Um, and this is a print off. Said I'm not quite done yet, but I think it's turned out adorable. Halloween is one of my favorite, favorite holidays. This is another uh, embossing folder that I embossed this tag or paper, and I made it a flip out. Not a flip out, but a pocket, a tuck spot. And then this, I forgot who I was watching, if it was Gail or Diane. They did these, this is made out of envelope, but I tacked it down as a pocket, but it's a tuck spot pocket here, has a pocket up here. This has a tuck spot and it's made out of envelope. So, isn't she adorable? And then I made this tag. And it's got a pocket here. It's also made out of the printout. And then so is this tag. And all of these are as well. So cute. So that goes right in this pocket. This is the actual, actually the closure of the envelope right there. And then it goes on. In. So I gotta find this book yet. I haven't had a chance to yet, but it'll get there. I want to get this in my shop, or if somebody's interested in buying it, that would be awesome. And this is um, just a paper clip from Tuesday morning. It's up for sale. Oops. And this is the other side of the paper. It's actually blank. Another tea dye that I use it um corrugated paper or card stock. This is a printout. This is from Recollections. And I just added some of the the um this eyelash um trim to it underneath it. That is so cute. 
these are from these doilies are from Stampin' Up that I just recently purchased and of course Tim Holtz a little girl ephemera stuck back there these are from Jolie these spiders and these are printouts from Messy. These are from Jolie uh, as well. This is um, Recollections. Yeah. Washi tape from this year. It's covering a bread. The spooked bread. That is from the Happy Hauntings collection. That I got from my yeah Happy Haunting my mind's eye is a bread that I got at Tuesday morning. And then same here. I think this is from Recollections, and it's a, just a sticker. And I put some of the eyelash trim behind it. And then there's a tab. And then another. Paper clip, another tuck spot that I made with the embossing envelope or embossing folder. I'm sorry, and I sewed it, sewed it on the paper, and I'm gonna take these bats and put them on the edges of any pages that. Uh, or 